Hello, my name is Darwin Bolden. I am one of three career coaches for Mobile County Public Schools. And today I will be presenting to you Essential Skills, the resume edition. So, why is a resume important? The resume is basically a marketing tool used to highlight your skills, accomplishments, etc. Almost each and every one in the job market today needs a resume. A resume is basically a self-portrait painting of yourself for employers. Um, it's well constructed, easy to read. It lists all your skills, your capabilities, and any kind of accomplishments that you have. The purpose is truly to intrigue an employer to hopefully call you in for an interview. So what should a resume include? It should definitely include your identification. Make sure that you list your name, your address, your telephone number, and email address. These are all ways that employers can contact you. Your resume should also include a small summary. This is typically three to five statements, basically describing your qualifications. You should definitely use terms like enthusiastic, hardworking, exit communicator. These all, these all are buzzwords that can be used in your summary. Also something that's important to add to your resume is your education. Basically list all your schools that you've attended, their names and locations. Also include the last grade that you completed and the year. And you also may want to add your grade point average. Another important portion of a resume is your experience. This includes jobs that you've been paid for or jobs that you haven't been paid for, which includes volunteer activities, etc. You should definitely list the name of the employer, the location, the date of the employment, as well as any type of job, skills, or duties that you experienced while working there. Please don't forget your job title. Here are a list of a few things that we consider experience. These are things that you necessarily did not get paid for. Those could be volunteer work, it could be babysitting, it could be yard work, dog walking, pet sitting. All of these are things that are considered as experience. Another thing to add to your resume are any type of achievements or activities that you're involved in. This could include sports, clubs, any type of awards that you uh, received from those particular clubs or sports would be great to list. Give you a quick example. Honor Roll, National Honor Society, Boy Scouts. This is not specific to organizations within your school. This also could include organizations that you're involved in outside of school. As we all know, computer skills are extremely important in the world that we live in today. Any type of skills that you have, a level of skills that you have, working with computers should be listed on your resume. This includes, or could include, any type of Microsoft Word or PowerPoint experience that you may have, any Excel experience. These are great things to list on your resume. So, character does truly count. Your employer may ask you for references. You may be wondering, what is a reference? A reference is typically an individual, a professional individual, that you know that can speak highly about you. Typically, it's a person that's not a family member, a person like a pastor, a teacher, maybe even a neighbor. Typically, you want to list three to five references on your resume. Here are a few tips you can use when developing a resume. Develop a rough draft and have someone proofread it. Keep the link at least one page and only use one type of font throughout the resume. Make sure that you use a font that's very, very easy to read, and I would stick to black ink. And here are a few don'ts. Don't include your whole life story in your resume. Don't use pronouns like I, me, and my. Don't use abbreviations or contraction words. Don't list the reason why you left a previous job. And most importantly, don't include your previous wages. And here's an example of a completed resume. If you follow all the instructions that we talked about earlier, hopefully your resume can look like this and land you that next job.